I was walking along probably Delamere Avenue, the main drag in Nairobi, which is now Kenyatta, walked by the window of East African Esso, and in the window was a little poster advertising a calendar competition. Well, back in those days, I, I had, I think it's safe to say I had zero suction on my production. I got, luckily still, lots of suction on my production now. I don't have any inventory. Everything I paint is gone. But in those days, I had no demand. So I, th and, and I would never enter a calendar competition <laughs> again. That was the only one I ever did. But I thought, well, why not? I'm teaching in Nigeria. I can paint in the evenings using my reference. By the way, I use uh, photographs for reference, uh, five to 50 photographs in the average painting, but a photograph is never enough, so I combine them. And so um, I entered the competition, and I put in uh, two entries. Uh, one was the Thompson Gazelle, which I still enjoy uh, looking at. I don't think I've ever done a better Thompson Gazelle. It's the main one. And uh, just at the beginning of my career, I was, I was influenced by some of the, the nature artists, uh, such as Roger Troy Peterson and Alan Brooks and the others, which would account for the plain background. It also shows off the animal better.